Mail time, mail time, mail, mail, mail time. Okay, so today's Tuesday. New books are coming out, and naturally, I have pre ordered some of them. This was supposed to be two boxes, actually, but the second one, for some reason, didn't come today, which is really weird because it's supposed to come today, and that second week in a row that I haven't gotten it on Tuesday. Because last week I got a book, it was just one, which is why I didn't make a video, and it came on Wednesday instead of Tuesday. A little disappointing there. But anyway, let's open this. Okay, this is Through the Zombie Glass by Gina Showalter, and it's the second book in the White Rabbit Chronicles, the first one being Alice in Zombieland, which is right there, and I really like this one, so naturally I ordered the second one. And it's pretty cool cover, I think, and these are also very cool inside. So the first one is green, so I guess this one is yellow. This says Curiouser and Curiouser. Right, curious. Apparently I can't speak today. Words. They're not easy. I really like this. Anyway, so it's a pretty decent sized book, which I'm very happy about. And I'll probably start reading it right away. I've been looking forward to this since I read the first one back in February. And I was like, oh, when is September going to be here so I can read the second one? And now, before I know it, September's here and I can read the second one. And I mentioned that I got a new book last week and it was just one, so I didn't make a video. But it was The Raven Boys by, I was gonna say, Gina Showalter, who is not the author of this book. It is Maggie Seabatter. And this is the second book in the Raven Psychos book. The first one was Raven Boys, right there. And it's a little weird, but I really ended up enjoying it, so I ordered the second one, and now the second one is here. And I have not read last week at all. I've only read like 27 pages of this. So I don't know if I'll continue reading this, or if I'll start this, or if I'll read both at the same time, which is not really something that I usually do or what, but I'm very excited for both of these books, so I will read one of them when I start reading again, because I've been in a non-reading mode lately. And since it's mail time, I thought I would share another package that came yesterday. It's from Bear Essentials. Last week they had a 12-hour rush uh, sale, online sale thing, and I received an email for it because I'm a member, a rewards member, so they send me emails about stuff. And my order came yesterday and I actually opened it because I kind of wanted to open it. But it was a pretty sweet deal. I got a whole kit of things and the original price of the things that I got was $104. I got it for $26 and also I got some free samples thrown in so that was a pretty sweet deal I think. So the first thing is this awesome pouch which is kind of like a makeup thing and it's really cool. Okay I'm gonna get back to pouch in a second but I got, oh, I don't know if you can see, but I got five different eyeshadows and then these two high shine eye color things. Okay, so the five eyeshadows that I got are in the colors of Lemon Zinger, which is this goldish color. Real Dew, which is like a greenish color. Imagination, which I thought was a pretty cool name, and it's like a bluish color. Uh, Banana Smoothie, which, you guessed it, is a yellow. And last but not least, we have Phoebe, which is like a purple, purplish color. Sorry if that was a little fuzzy. These two are pretty cool. One of them is a bronzer and the other one is ice. That's the colors. Okay, so this one is the ice. And it has this really cool like brush inside. 
Yeah, and that's kind of what it looks like. It's really shimmery and shiny and it's very cool. And the other one is the bronzer. So that's this lovely color. And again, it's the same one with the applicator inside. And this is kind of what it looks like. So I think they're very cool and very easy to use, which is pretty awesome. Okay, and back to the bag. So, up here it has a little thing for brushes and this brush actually came with it. It is the ID Seamless Blending, so it has a bigger one on one side and a smaller one on the other. So it's like a double sided brush and this is where the brushes go and I'm not really sure what goes in this little thing or this little thing but this is nice and then on the side is like a bigger place to put things and this actually expands it becomes like a really nice little travel case and not all of these things so far are just $26 and the original price for that kit is $104 and I thought it was a pretty sweet deal. Now I just hope that I actually use these things because I don't really do a lot of makeup. Actually, I don't really do any makeup, but I want to learn, so gotta start somewhere. And then the little sample that I got are the Primetime Foundation Primer, and this is like a neutralizing one, and it's just this little packet here. I also got a sample of a foundation which is in medium beige and it's just a little thing and it has a little magnet closing which is very cool. I think that these kinds of samples are really really cute. And last but not least I got the Naturally Luminous Duo for combination skin because that's what mine kind of is and it includes a purifying facial cleanser and a purely nourishing moisturizer so it's like you use this one first and then to cleanse your skin and then this one to moisturize so that is cool and then this is slightly old now but I went to Yankee Candle because I really like candles and also it is the fall season now and I really want to decorate so I got this little tea light holder that I thought was really pretty so I can start decorating now and I also got some candles because you can't go to any candle and not get a candle I got three of these votives and I got the beach walk which smells absolutely amazing and uh, over the river which also smells quite amazing and also the Midsummer Stream which is like a darker candle and it smells so good even though I can't really smell it through this thing but I was able to smell it in the store and it smells really good so I'm very excited to light them up and then the book that I did not receive today even though I was supposed to is Untold by Sarah Reese Brennan and it is I think the second book in the Labyrinth Legacy series. Not sure. It was part of a pre-ordering bench, so I'm not really exactly sure what it's about, which is why I'm not that mad that it doesn't arrive today, because I wasn't like expecting it as much as say through the zombie glass, because if I hadn't received that one today, I would have been a little pissed. But anyway, this is it for today's mail time slash polling things. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you again very soon. Bye!